had the cockpit opened up a little bit. I'm resealing this cockpit sole hatch cover. Goes down below. Just took apart the um, wheel steering and tightened it up a little bit, greased it. Definitely like to get rid of it. There's the emergency tiller slot. I took some pictures for you. It looks like it's it's down about uh, two and a half inches below the sole. It's about 12 inches uh, off the aft locker. And it's um, pretty much centered in the cockpit, of course. I think about around a foot. I've got the measurements. Um, wheel to tiller conversion is a big thing I want to do. Uh, also, might be kind of tough to see because I've got such a mess, but the cockpit lockers hinge on the teak. Um, the lockers are bolted to the, or screwed to the teak grates, and then those are screwed in to the fiberglass. And I was thinking I'd like to get rid of the teak, so probably thinking about just redoing the lockers so they bolt straight onto the fiberglass. I'd also like to um, see about creating a little bit of a seal for those. I've got some gasketing material. I'm not sure if that's worth doing or how to do it, but maybe you have some thoughts on that. This is the old propane system I'm going to pull out. Uh, other than that, I guess while we're looking at the cockpit, I would like to get your thoughts on the scupper situation. Um, I just have two cockpit drains, I guess drains, be a better word, um, forward. I was thinking maybe they could be enlarged. Looks like the interior dimensions about an inch and a half here's the other one or possibly depending on the slope of the cockpit maybe it makes sense to put a couple more drains in the back anyway that's probably enough on the cockpit I need to do some hatch work but I feel pretty confident on that part so thank you